I'm just doing a quick video here of a uh, comparison between the top of the line HIDs, which is a, right here is a 10 watt Knight Rider versus our LEDs, which employ either an SST50 LED or top of the line SST90 LEDs. Um, here's a quick sample. This is the Knight Rider um, 10 watt HID system on high. And uh, you could kind of move it, move it down so I could see in front, kind of. You see it. And it's brightness and then move it up the hill a little bit and uh, it's, it's, it's pretty bright but once you're used to our LEDs it, it's not it doesn't really compare that well you'll see in a second okay then next you could turn that off next is uh, our LED system this particular system on this bike was set up with uh, dual flooding SST 90s on the handlebars and um, that's I think one or two together and also a thrower SST50 so you can get good distance and a lot of spill um, hopefully you can see that alright what it looks like on video but um, can you tilt them down so you can see the light in front, directly in front of us the lights down? Okay. yeah so it is a lot of light way 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 brighter than uh, what we just saw and the flood is tremendous as you can see hopefully it lights up everything in front of you um, yeah, t tilt it up again. You can see a lot further in front of you. Um, judging by the video, I can see it a lot better with my eyes than what actually shows up. Um, we'll see how it looks when it goes to the computer. But that's about it. It's a comparison between the, the LEDs and the HID 10 watt system. Uh, the most important thing here is the 10 watt HID system is $550 and our LED systems are substantially less. Um, you can take a look at our website, www.high-powercycles.com, and uh, you can see our selection.